Hello everyone. In this week's theory video, we are going to be talking about leavening agents. A leavening agent is a substance that causes dough to expand by releasing gas once mixed with liquid, acid, or heat. Rising agents give baked goods optimal volume, texture, and crumb, and can include baking soda, baking powder, whipped egg whites, cream, or even steam. The two most commonly used leavening agents in baking are baking powder and baking soda. While the two look alike. Baking soda is made up of small white crystals. Baking soda to get activated in a recipe, it requires an acidic ingredient as well as a liquid. Whereas for baking powder to work, all it requires is liquid and heat. While the two have similar properties, they cannot be used interchangeably. Baking soda is much stronger than baking powder, and you're likely to need three times the amount of baking powder. instead of soda to create the same rising effect another commonly used leavening agent is yeast it is available in various forms such as instant yeast active dry and fresh yeast instant yeast as the name suggests is meant to give a quick and easy rise to your bread it is also the strongest form of yeast it also has a very long shelf life so if kept in the freezer it can stay fresh for up to 2 years active dry yeast is the second strongest form of yeast and very similar to instant yeast however the main difference is it requires to be proofed before adding to the dough this too has a very long shelf life and can be stored in the freezer for up to 2 years if a recipe calls for active dry yeast but what you have is instant yeast all you have to do is use 3/4 of the quantity The last form of yeast is fresh yeast. Fresh yeast is highly perishable and sold in big blocks of 500 grams. It has a shelf life of only 2 to 3 days in the fridge. It is commonly used by local bakeries that have a large amount of bread to be produced each day. The next type of leavening agent is steam. The rise in any form of shoe pastry is produced solely by the steam. Puff pastry is an another example of where steam is used to create leavening. The water present in the butter chunks in puff pastry help push the layers apart and give a very flaky texture to the pastry. Whipped eggs or whipped aquafaba is another form of leavening agent. A Japanese cheesecake is a classic example where whipped eggs are used to increase the size of the cake. While whisking, the air gets trapped inside the egg whites and is released during baking and leaves a good texture and structure of the cake. 